Good day, South Africa. This is Dr. Arthur Frost speaking. And it is day uh, 13 of our countdown. I want us to go to Micah chapter 2, verse 13. All right? And it says this. He who opens the breach goes up before them. They break through and pass the gate going by it. The king passes on before them and the Lord is at their head. What does that mean? It means that as we pray, as the body of Christ prays, we are going on ahead and breaking the bars open in Jesus' name. And so as we stand in the gap and pray, we will see the power and the glory of God be made manifest in this nation. So let's pray. Father, right now in the name of Jesus, we stand in agreement and we pray over this nation. And Lord, that we go and breach what needs to be breached. We break through what needs to be broken through in the spirit. Lord, we release the power of God over this nation. We release the glory of God over this nation. We release the peace of God over this nation. Father, I thank you that our nation is blessed and that the power of God will be seen right across our nation. Thank you, Lord, that as we stand and we build the altars, Lord, that we will see the blessing, the power and the glory and the promises of God be made clear and evident over our nation in Jesus' mighty name. And everybody said, Amen and Amen. God bless you. See you soon. Greetings in the mighty name of Jesus. My name is Sigilam Tolo. I'm a child of God. I love the Lord Jesus with all of my heart under the leadership of Dr. Arthur Frost. I would like to read in Psalm 20, verse 6 to 9. Now this I know. The Lord gives victory to his anointed. He answers him from his heavenly sanctuary with the victorious power of his right hand. Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of the Lord, our God. They are brought to their knees and fall, but we rise up and stand firm. Lord, give victory to the king. Answer us when we call. Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we come before you. We come before you with an expectation. We come before you, Lord, with a knowledge that you are the one that gives your anointed one victory. Lord, we thank you that as we go on our knees and pray as the body of Christ, we are confident, we are persuaded that you answer clearly from heaven you answer with your victorious power in your right hand lord we pray that you may stretch forth your hand and remember south africa even as we are approaching the elections lord god almighty our trust is not in men our trust is in you some trust in chariots some trust in horses but we have come in the name of the Lord. We trust in your name. That is a strong tower that, Lord, when we run into it, as you are doing right now, we have a safe place. Father, we thank you that we can decree and declare that South Africa is a safe place, for we have run into the name of the Lord. There is peace. There is great joy. For, Lord, you will answer the king in the mighty name of Jesus and give victory to the king. Lord, I thank you that you are the king of earth. You are the king of South Africa. And we will see you moving in our elections this year. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Good day, saints. If you are receiving this message via WhatsApp or via Facebook and you would like to receive these messages directly to your phone via WhatsApp, Please just WhatsApp me directly. Please do not SMS me. WhatsApp me the word add, A double D, all right, to 082 659 And then you'll get a link that will be sent to you. Just click on the link. You can join the group. And every day we will send you uh, the election um, countdown, all right? And I'm going to ask you, please, once again, to forward it to as many people as you can when you do get them. So God bless you. Have an awesome day. And thank you for joining in as we believe God for a supernatural election. Love you lot. See you soon. Amen and amen.